हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू द माइट चैंपियनशिप ट्रॉफी हेयर वी हैव इन द सेमीफाइनल एंड वी हैव सी एस सी ए एंड स्कूल ऑफ लॉ सो द स्कोर राइट नाउ इज थर्टी फाइव फॉर द लॉस ऑफ थ्री विकेट्स एंड द ओवर्स आर फाइव पॉइंट फाइव ओवर्स सो करेंटली वी हैव द बैट्समैन सबीर फतेदार हु हैज स्कोर्ड नाइनटीन रन इन ट्वेंटी बॉल्स We have new batsman in the ground, Ankit Pandita. We have new batsman in the ground, Ankit Pandita. The score for the CSE is 35 for the loss of three wickets.
So the score for CSC is 37 for the loss of 3 wickets in 6.1 hours. Sabir Fotedar is playing really good for the team. CSC had lost 3 crucial wickets. And in field we have Sabir Fotedar and Ankit Pandita. Both of them are playing really great. So CSC needs to stabilize their batting right now. They don't need to go for attack because they have lost few crucial wickets. The wicket of Dhruv was very crucial for them. Ankit Pandita has changed his gear. He is batting with a very good strike rate. He has just played three balls and scored eight runs. Ankit can be dangerous for the school of law. And all hopes are on CSCA. Can Ankit take them to a good total? Savir Fotedar on strike. They are looking for just strike rotate now. Ankit Pandra is batting really good. So Samir just need to give him the strike so that he can hit hard. Semi final number one, BBA with us. So we have the captain from the winning team. So what's your name? My name is Punya Ranan from BBA department. So Punya, how are you feeling defeating such a big team of civil engineering department who have won back-to-back -back finals at my Premier League? It was a great opportunity for my team and myself. 
Uh, I'm very proud of my team, the way they performed, everyone performed. We played as a uni united team and uh, all the teamwork and hard work we have practiced in our college halls after there. So it was a good work for team as well. So what about sports meet? MIT Jammu has organized such a good sports meet. The league matches at Grota Stadium, now the finals and semi finals at the International Stadium, MA Stadium. So how are you feeling about this sports meet? Might has provided us platform to provide uh, to to keep our show to show our talent to the whole Jammu. And because uh, everyone not play professionally around, so they have got the chance to show their skills uh, in a professional game. So I don't think so anybody from Jammu Kashmir gives this such a big platform to all the uh, college teams as well, because uh, most professionally professional colleges are do so much. But I'm very proud of my. Experience. So what about facilities you are getting here? Uh, the sportsmen you are getting here, the groundsmen you are getting here, live streaming, YouTube live is happening there, and all the uh, facilities from the sports committee. What about that? How do you feel like we are playing international cricket? We so really it's really good, yeah. yeah. Like you are we feeling are really like you are of. playing in a big stage. So you have qualified for the finals. So how yeah. is the feeling? We are really excited. You are really excited to lift the trophy soon. So congratulations, Punya. Looking mm -hmm. forward to see you in final. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Engineering department, Himal Gupta with us. Himal, how are you feeling about this sports meet? It's a really great initiative. Live streaming is there, yes. all the facilities are there. What are you feeling about? But what do you want to say about college and this sports meet? Whenever events like these uh, happen, it's a, it really helps a lot of uh, people who uh, are looking to get into these sports. Uh, it helps a lot of us to uh, know what we, uh, where we stand, uh, what we want to pursue in future. In future. Uh, in sports and that's a great initiative. I really appreciate that. Mr. Ankur uh, sir, our director, Gongli sir, he's really doing it uh, very well and I'm looking forward to it in the future also. So Himal, last match you played with BBN, scored huge target of 97 runs, which were just uh, there for win. But what went wrong for your team, where you lost the match, what are your about views on that? I think we played uh, well, but they also played uh, very well. So it, it was not that we lost it. It, it's what, it was that they won the match. So it was good. Uh, we'll keep, we'll uh, look uh, what we did uh, wrong and we'll uh, try to better it and uh, play it in the future. So you have having, having a next match for the third place. So are you looking forward for that? Yes, yes, we are looking forward to it. It, it will be a super over. So we are looking forward to it to, win, to a secure third position. That's it. Best of luck for that match. Hopefully you will secure bronze. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you.
Oh no, no, no. After first innings, we have 95 per 5. CSC has scored 95 per 5 wickets. So, score is a bit similar to Civil, but Civil has scored last innings. This time both the teams who had played final for the last two years are in trouble. But nice score by CSC after having 37 runs in 5 overs to 95 runs in 10 overs. Sabir Fatehdar has really batted good today. Had a strike rate of 155. And Ankit Pandita was also very good with a strike rate of 162. So, inning breaks is there and we have Saurabh sir with us. So, Saurabh sir, CSE has scored 95 runs in 10 hours. What do you think? Uh, Are these sufficient? Yeah, I think it's a good score but we need to bowl well. We need to bowl actually good length in good length areas. Actually, wicket is very good. If you bowl in good length areas, then I'm sure the score will be defendable. In the semi-final, when the score was also 96 but still yeah. the... But actually, in the death overs, they didn't bowl well. So, I think if our team will bowl in good areas, surely we can defend this. Team. So, you think if the CSC bowlers will bowl in the pitch, in the line, they can yeah. win this match? Yeah, yeah. If you, if you don't over pitch too much, then it will be defendable, definitely. So, we have an inning breaks of 5 to 10 minutes and after that, we'll see would CSC will be able to defend this total or School of Law will move on towards the final. Let's see. Yeah, sure. Good luck to both teams.
और यहाँ पे हमारे पास एक ये है जिसका नाम है रणबीर सिंह चौहान बहुत आपकी बीच आगे बहुत शक्त कह रहा है कैसे बॉल आनी है प्लीज Now check, it's working. Wait. 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 Wait.
अगर मैच की पहली बॉल पे छक्का आएगा तो हजार रुपए उनके नाम से अतुल आपके एक अतुल मेरा नाम सुवीर सुवीर कह रहे हैं आप अगर मैच की पहली बॉल पे सिक्स मारेंगे उनके नाम से थाउजेंड रुपीज आपको कैसा लग रहा है लास्ट बॉल पे जो उन्होंने बाउंड्री से चौका नहीं सिंगल से लिया उस फील्डिंग के बारे में क्या कहना चाहोगे आप मैं बस यही कहना चाहूंगा थोड़ा सा अंडरस्टैंडिंग नहीं थी आप इसमें फील्डर और कीपर की नहीं तो वो चार रन नहीं हो सकते थे सिंगल बन सकता था लेकिन चलो जो भी हुआ आप बैटिंग से हम जीतेंगे सीएसी के साथ सीएसी को हम काफी प्रचार करेंगे आज हमारे बल्लेबाज जो दो ओपनर बल्लेबाज गए हुए जी बिल्कुल आपका जो कॉन्फिडेंस है ना आई लाइक इट ठीक है सर ओके सर खरास पार्टी सर वहां पे उधर कुछ भी बोल रहे हैं देख लो अगर चल जाए क्या मैं कर लेता हूं अंगमेट खरास पार्टी यहां पे रेडी है हर रिटर्न माना जा रहे हैं इनको मैक्सवेल का रूप कहा जा रहा है मैक्सवेल के नाम से इनको जाना जाता है स्कूल ऑफ लॉ में
Dhruv, no, we have another Dhruv. So yes, he is playing with two Dhruvs, and they are just. So Dhruv with the first ball of second over, Amit Sharma on strike. A good ball. It's a huge appeal. But the empire has shown no interest in this appeal. So no Dhruv with the second ball and a good shot from Amit Sharma and one run only. There can be our throw, but we need to see who will win this match: CSCA or School of Law. In the stands, we can see BBA just waiting for the another finalist. One point two overs, nine for the loss of zero wickets. But school of law needs to play fast now. They need some heat because 
Without this, they cannot utilize the... Oh, it's a huge hit! And it's a big six! Huge six! Stand and deliver! What a shot from Atul Sani! It was just a stand and deliver shot. I can tell you if Atul Sani plays this match, till then, he'll just get this match completed in seven hours. It was a huge six. Pressure on Dhruv. Dhruv in another wall. Another hit. And wide wall. For scores, you are also screen on screen. You can also visit Crick Heroes app. Welcome to my championship trophy. We are live from Ami Stadium. It's a beautiful ground and beautiful bowling from Dhruv. After that fix, he has done his comeback. He is playing really good. Dhruv Sharma with another ball. Miscommunication, it can be a run out. It's an aggressive field from CSEA. Computer science department. Dhruv Sharma with his last gain. Just pushed for a single and good fielding. After completion of two overs, we have 17 for the loss of zero wickets. So the third hour has started. So this is a pressure releasing hour. There can be huge runs in this hour and there can be wickets in this hour because school of law is in pressure right now. They need to score some runs because the target is huge. The run rate is increasing with every ball. So they are looking forward to hit in this over. And the bowler we have. Amit. And it's a wicket. Very good effort from the CSC department. Very good effort.
So Ankit Pandita is the new bowler. And on strike we have Amit Sharma. Atul Sani is batting really good from School of Law. But we need to see whether he will get the support from Amit or Amit will depart. Because if Amit will keep on doing playing slow, the pressure will be on Atul Sani. So let's see. Amit on strike. And Ankit Pandita with the ball. Ankit Pandita is also a very good bowler. Overall, CSC is having a good bowling lineup. With some aggressive field. Just flicked around and looking forward for single. It can be a run out. Not a good throw. But CSC is having some aggressive field and pressurizing school of law. This over is the defensive over and we need to see whether school of law will hit some or not because it is the last over of power play. So now the whole pressure is on School of Law. It's 2.4 over and it's 24 the loss of 0 wickets. The pressure is on the openers. They need to score because it's the last hour of power play. After this hour, the field will be open. And it will be difficult to score some boundaries. Ankit Pandita with the fifth ball. The batsmen are desperate to hit right now, but a good bowling from Ankit Pandita. It's he's bowling really good. The overall bowling unit of CSCA is really good. That is why they are looking so confident after scoring 95. And the pressure is in the batting side right now. Especially Amit Sharma. He's just playing with a strike rate of 40, which is not sufficient. And it's a wicket. You can see the pressure on Amit Sharma, and it's just a clean bold. Amit departs. Amit with the jersey number of nine departs, and now the pressure continues on school of law. Our completion of three hours and the cleaning of our play, we have to be for the gates of our own school of. Law. The next batsman is for us, but he is coming with the big identity of power hitter. He has played big leagues like Istvar Premier League and School of Law has huge hopes on him. So, this bat for us, but is really good for them.
have fast button strike and he is coming the big operation of power Rangers. he played big league like Star premier league and all the top low department are in him more. let's see what Faraz but can do for them right now school of law is in huge pressure csc is pressurizing them and playing with aggressive field let's see whether csc can qualify for another final or they, they'll just go for from semi final to the home csc will is also waiting for will play with them let's see the right now the score of school of law is 24 one the loss of three years Being a bit aggressive and judging school law. I thought just need to give a signal to Farah, but because the audience wants to see Farah's bird. Big part. Adhani is releasing pressure. Adhani is playing very good. And if this part of the news between Adhani and Rajbert, they can really defeat the CSCA team. School of Law has the potential. They have played really good in Grota Stadium in the league stages match. And we have seen in the semi final match that there is no. We have Nanni from CC with us, so she will join us for the commentary. So, over to you, Nanni. Tadai from Atul Chani. This is the sportsman spirit. He is showing really good effort. Just demanding that Farazbert should be on strike, and now we have Farazbert on strike. 
जर्सी बट ही कैन डू नाइन नंबर जर्सी फराज बट विद बिग रेपुटेशन ऑफ अ पावर हिटर ही हैज शोन हिज Madrasin with his last ball of the and Faraz on strike. Faraz, the shot of the game and have won. So after completion of four overs, we have thirty-four for one. Atul Sani has sit for the rest, uh, rest, and the physio is in the field. With the water boys, after four hours, we have thirty-four for one. Players are taking a breath and resting for a while. Great shot by School of Law and. For us, but is not called a great shot or great hitter for a reason. He is called a great hitter for a reason, guys. Faraz but on strike again and attacking bowling from Ankit Pandita. Ankit Pandita from CSC is bowling really great. As but again the pitch, everyone has great expectations from him. And goal! Beautiful wicket. Faraz goes and so goes the match for BBL LB. Can Faraz stay on this wicket? The reputation which Faraz was coming, he is in match expectation of the team. The new batter arrives, and the pressure is now on School of Law. Asbert is going back with four runs on four balls. Yeah. 
Mr. Furkan is replacing Faraz Bhatt now on the pitch. School of Law is in great pressure. They need to improve their game. They need to play even better now. School of Law requires 57 runs and 32 balls. Let's see if they can do it or not. That was a good dot ball. Nice delivery by Ankit Pandita. Pandita is really economical for CSE department. He has just got for seven runs and has taken two wickets. Pandita is really a great asset and he has taken another wicket and celebration begins. Children has stayed baller and they are really happy. Right now, the tested CSE is showing that they are just looking forward to win this match and Batsman has gone out and he is not happy. Furan goes for a duck. It's a golden duck. Furan goes in and Furkan comes out. And now we have Atisham Ahmed. Right now, what the scenario is, School of Law is going in and School of Law is coming out. They need to stand on wicket, they need to see the deliveries and then play. CSE is showing why they are a big team in this tournament. Experience, the captaincy from Dhub Sharma is really exceptional. And the bowling line what they are having, two droves, Ankit Pandita. They are, they are a really good bowling unit. Really throwing the good deliveries and Ankit Pandita is really good as for their team. Adhushani has also played really good. The captain of the side is standing on a standing lonely, I can say. No one is supporting him on the ground. He has scored 25 runs in 18 balls and batting with a strike rate of 138. Someone needs to support Atul and they can go forward for the target. Surely, surely, CSE is doing an amazing game. They are playing, their hearts are, they are moving. They are not an easy win. They are not easy to defeat. School of Law need to put more efforts in order to stay in the game. We can see that BBLLB is having a huge crowd in the stadium, but there is a pin drop silence right now in the stands because CSC has made everyone quiet in the stadium. They are really playing good cricket here and there is a silence within the audience right now. Great support for the BBLLB. Department is here to cheer them, but uh, hopefully not really for the ground. They are not playing good cricket.
So uh, we can see the, the CSC players are really excited right now. They have gone for two extras, but they need to be patient because we have seen in cricket another wicket. They are just playing some aggressive cricket over School of Law. School of Law is definitely disappointed. We can see it. The batsman just amazing cricket by CSC. They are enjoying. They are celebrating right now. I guess they are certain about their victory. Required run rate has moved from 8 to 11. Required run rate is 11 right now and currently they are batting at a strike rate, a run rate of 8. It's not good and they require 53 runs in 28 balls and they need to play with a strike rate of 200. They are 3 wickets down and Atul Sani is the lone warrior there for the school of law. He is playing a captain innings right now. Captain is leading from the front, but he needs some support from the team. Someone needs to support him and they can just achieve a good target. So, Nandini, what do you want to say about the weather conditions here and the stadium, the beautiful MA Stadium, Mulan Azad Stadium here in Jammu? Um, that's uh, really a great question because the, our stadium is definitely providing the perfect pitch for the players to play. It's such a huge stadium for the players to play, to showcase their talent, to showcase what the people of Jammu, the students of might, uh, possess their potential in the field of cricket. And uh, definitely it's a beautiful sunny day. A bit tiring, but who would like a, sun, uh, a rainy day on such a beautiful day? We would definitely prefer a sunny day and it is what we want. We're at the Molana Azad Stadium, a beautiful stadium within Tavi, Jammu and uh, what, a delivery, what, a what a delivery from the bowler. It's really a good delivery and CSC department is playing really amazing cricket. Shot from Kesar Murtuja, but a brilliant feeling from CSC team. Big shot, but they only got one run only. We have Ahatissam Ahmad and Kesar Murtaza on the field playing from the side of School of Law. They are playing in a huge pressure. The whole pressure to carry the team in this game is on their shoulders. We need to see what they could do now. School of Law requires 51 runs in 24 balls. Do you think, Raghav, it is possible for them to score this? Yeah, in cricket anything can be possible, but they need to play with a good strike rate right now. They need to score big and this hour can be a decisive hour for them. They need to go after the bowler in, in any one hour. They need to pick the bowler whom they want to hit. Because without hitting, they cannot win the match. Yeah. The strike rate which they are playing right now is only 7.50. Current run rate is there. And they require 12.75 and they need to go for at least 20 to 25 runs in an hour that, to bring the strike rate down. Over to you, Nandini. I don't believe any would, anyone will disagree on uh, that CSE seriously have gems when it comes to bowling. The bowlers are doing so great. The fielding is top notch. And everybody is playing their hearts out. But what we have seen with CSE team is that uh, in the last tournament in the league stages, they choke with their death bowling. Let's see how the death bowling goes because they get hit in the death, death hours. So let's see how the uh, match will go onward. We still have four hours left. 
the target is still huge they need 51 runs in 24 balls but it is it is achievable what do you think nandini definitely definitely i just said anything is possible in cricket and this is might cricket so the players are amazing they are giving their hearts It's the second season of the Might Championship Trophy. It's a good uh, championship series, which is, which was started from the. It's a huge wicket between them, and the CSC again strikes. It's amazing. The match is going in the pocket of CSC directly, and they are just playing some brilliant cricket here in the Ahmed Stadium. Jump. So we will be talking about the Might Championship Trophy. It's the second season of the Might Championship Trophy, and. Last year also CSC qualified for the finals. We have the new batsman Raja Vasim, so we need to see whether Vasim can bat like a Raja or not. School of Raw needs him. School of Law has a lot of expectation from Raja Vasim. School of Raw requires 50 runs in 23 balls. On pitch we have Raja Vasim, Kesar Murtaza. School of Law has a lot of expectations from the batsmen. Beautiful shot and misfielding by CSC. School of Law went for two runs. Beautiful shot and great fielding by CSC. But we have seen the luck is also not with the BBA department, BBA law, because uh, every time their batsman hits the ball, it's only. Beautiful ball by Sushant and beautiful shot from School of Law. Fielding is tight. They are not letting them steal runs. They are not letting them touch the boundary. CS is really, really showcasing their talent when it comes to fielding and bowling, of course. The bowlers surely have surprised everyone in the stadium. Everyone is very impressed by the bowling of CSC. And School of Law needs to buckle up now.
and Shushant is going for the ball and it was a dot ball it was a dot ball great bowling by CSE there is no doubt CSE is literally coming up as the alpha when it comes to the bowling I guess Again, a dot ball. Dhruv is balling now. Oh, they are going for a single. School of Law is going for a single. Oh. Captain came and captain gone. First ball for the four. Beautiful shot. School of Law just earned a four run. It was a wide ball. Great fielding by CSE, great fielding by CSE. was a beautiful catch they are celebrating okay school of law is claiming school of law claimed that the fielder just touched the ball on the boundaries while he was celebrating so we are waiting for the decision in school of law We'll get a a, a catch out or a six run.
Oh my god, the celebration went wrong and the school of law just earned a six run. School of law have really buckled up and they are playing really well now. Ball is again in the air. Is it going to be a catch? Okay, okay, okay. They went for double, I guess. Kesa Murtaza is playing really, really well for their own team. The score currently is 68 runs on 5 wickets. School of Law requires 28 runs in 80, 14 balls. It was a beautiful ball. Beautiful shot. Okay, CAC is doing a great work in fielding. And the school of law went for doubles. Beautiful view of the tricolor, our national flag. PSC team. Team is discussing their strategies. They might change their strategies.
Raja Vaseem will be on the pitch. School of Law, 70 with 5 wickets. School of Law requires 26 runs in 12 balls.